My name is Moira and I'm from eFit30. Come and join me in a six week boot camp challenge and work out like an athlete. We have coaching advice, a diet plan and 30 minutes worth of exercise for you to do every day. Let's get you into winning condition. Hi, my name's Maura and I'll be taking you through week four of our six week challenge. Let's start today by skipping. So if you've got a skipping rope, that's awesome, but if not, you can just jump on the spot. Keeping nice and light on your feet, we want little fast, fast double footed bounces. Good work. Just getting that heart rate up now. Tell your body, I'm gonna be exercising today. We've got a half an hour workout. Good work. We wanna have our elbows nice and soft, and our wrist should be about waist high. A little bit longer. So today we're gonna to be doing three sets of three different exercises and we're going to be having a small break in between each. Ten more seconds. And putting that rope down. Let's do some dynamic warm-up moves. We'll just start with some little arm circles. That's it. Any bigger. Bigger, come here and crush your body. Let's go back the other way. That's it. Some shoulder rolls back. That's it, and forwards. Good work. Let's come into a twist, raising that opposite back ankle as we go around. Nice release for the trunk. Now we'll come into a little squat pulse. Nearly there. Let's get straight into this workout. The first thing we're gonna do is coming into squats. So away we go. We've got five seconds. We're just gonna go our feet shoulder width apart and away we go. We're just sitting nice and deep into it. We've got 30 seconds. So each different set is gonna build on the previous set. So this is kind of our warm up set. Just getting used to those actions. Then we're just gonna progress through it. We've got 10 seconds to go. Take it nice and slow and controlled. Keeping strong through the core. Pushing up, that's it. And that's 30 seconds down. We're coming down onto the mat now. We're going straight into crunches. So I want you, having your legs bent, we're going to put our hands onto our thighs. We're gonna chuck our chin in and coming up, looking just over your lady bits. You might be able to see your, your feet. I'm gonna come up just into a small crunch. Again, we've got 30 seconds. Breathing as we're going up every time. And next we're going to push up, so turning over. If you need to, go onto your knees and coming down. If you can, let's start on our toes. And we've got 30 seconds. Breathing out as we're pushing up. Stay nice and strong through that core. That's it. Two, one. Great work. Come back into child's pose. We've got a small break, we've got a 30 second break. That's our first set done. And our next set's gonna work on that one. So with the squat, we're gonna bring our feet out wide. It's a sumo squat. Then we're going to bring our elbow up to our knee. So we're gonna come down, then we're gonna bring our elbow up, 
and down and keep alternating. You guys ready? And away we go. So up, down. Our feet should be 90 degree angles and we don't want those knees coming over our feet when we're all in a line. That's it, got 15 seconds, coming down nice and low. That's it, bringing our knees to our elbow every time. Now there, five seconds. Coming down, awesome, back down onto the mat. We've got leg raises. So you can have your hands with your palms facing upwards. We're going to raise our legs up and down. Nice and slow and controlled using our abs. Our whole core is working here. If that's too hard, reduce the lever length and you can just keep going up and down. Up and down. That's it. Next we've got mountain climbers. So turning over into the standard push-up position and we're bringing our knee through our hands and then switching. So our hands should be over underneath our shoulders, sorry. And then let's go nice and fast. Keeping your core engaged. We've got 10 seconds. Keep it up at home. It's looking great. And rest. So that's your next set. We've got one more to go. This is gonna be the hardest one. You've got 20 seconds, then we're straight into it. We're gonna go with squat jumps for our first one. So again, we're coming with our feet just a little bit wider than shoulder width apart. We're coming down and then jumping back up. We're gonna come down nice and low, jumping nice and high. Are you ready? We've got 30 seconds. Away we go. Down, jumping up. Landing nice and lightly on your feet. That's it. 20 seconds to go, keep it up. Remembering to breathe. Sitting nice and deep into it. 10 seconds. You start to feel it, can't you? It's lactic. Five seconds. One more. Great work, shake it out. We're coming straight back down onto our backs. We're gonna come into a bicycle. So we're gonna bring our elbow into our knee and then into the opposite knee and then switch. Switch, switch. That's it. This is targeting your obliques as well. You're nearly there. Three, two, one, and relax. This is probably the hardest Exercise out of the whole workout, we're into burpees. So, we're jumping up, we're squatting down, our hands are going down, jumping our legs out, jumping our legs out, and up, back down. That's it. So up, down. If this is too easy for you, I want you to add a push-up in. That's it. And jumping up. You've got to rest, you've got 30 seconds, and we're back into that first set. Whew. Gets tiring, doesn't it? So we're going straight back into our normal squats. So with your feet shoulder width apart. We've got 10 seconds, so catch your breath. Are you ready? Set in place, and away we go. Coming down, sit. These seem easy now compared to the other ones, don't they? It's okay, we'll get there. Enjoy it while it lasts. That's it. Making sure we've got a nice neutral pelvis. Got 15 seconds, we're halfway. Coming down nice and low every time. Hopefully squats are a bit easy for you now compared to your first week. Three, two, Great work, coming down onto the mat now. We've got crunches. So again, hands on the thighs, your chin is tucked in and we're just coming up just that little bit. We're just gonna keep it going, yeah. Engaging the core, belly button and spine. You're looking through your lady bits. 
Nearly there, five seconds. That's it, turning over onto your front. If you can, start out on your toes. If not, it's completely fine. We're coming down, making sure we've got a quick change over from exercise to exercise. We don't want to waste any time. Make sure that bottom's tucked in. We've got a flat plank position. 10 seconds, keep it up. Breathing out as we're pushing up. That's it. Last one of the set. And relax, coming back into child's pose and catching your breath. First set of second set down. Fifteen seconds. Let's come back up. So we're going to start doing that in that sumo squat position. So making sure our legs are nice and wide, 45 degree angle with the feet. We're coming down nice and low. Let's go. And up, down, up. See it coming low every single time, as low as you can go. If you can, try to pick up the intensity while still keeping your good technique. You've got 10 seconds, keep it up. Let's stay nice and upright. Three, two, one. Great work. We're into our leg raises. So again, if you need to, keep that lever length nice and small to make it easier. If you can, legs out. Nice and controlled. That's it. We're trying to press that lower back into the mat. Keep your legs as straight as you can. Great work. Turning over into your front. We're going straight into mountain climbers. And away we go. That's it, let's get this heart rate up. Keep that core locked in. We don't want elevator, we don't want your bottom up. We keep nice and low. Bring your knees through. 10 seconds. Let's go now. Let's get that heart rate high. Great work, 30 seconds break. If you feel like you need to um, see what you look like instead of just feeling it, you can always use a mirror. Have a mirror next to your TV or your computer and you can have a look and correct anything you see is wrong. If you've got 10 more seconds and we're into a hard set. We're nearly there and then you've got a break. We're gonna start off with our um, squat jumps this time. So again, shoulder width apart. Let's go, nice and high. Coming nice and lightly down. The more force you apply down, the more, um, the greater reaction force you've got. Newton's third law. That's it. 10 seconds, that's it, getting down nice and low. Five seconds, good work. How are you going at home? One more, jumping up. You've got 30 seconds break. Oh no, you don't, sorry. I lied, you were down into bicycles. Are you ready? Away we go, straight into it. That's it, let's make these nice and fast. Extending those legs fully. As you get tired, I don't want you getting slower. I don't want your technique getting worse. I want you to keep it up the whole time. We've only got another five seconds. Great work. Let's jump up, we've got burpees. You've got a break, half of these burpees, let's go. Ten seconds. Let's hit one more. And jumping up. You've got a small break, go catch your breath, grab a small drink of water, and then we'll get straight back into it. Hi, welcome.
welcome back. Hope you had a great break. We're going to go straight back into our first set, which was squats. Are you ready? Away we go. So making sure we're breathing as we're sitting back. Nice and neutral pelvis, coming down nice and deep. That's it. Great work. So again, we're going back to our easiest set and we're just gonna get harder and harder. That's it. Got five seconds to go. And we're coming straight down. Let's move through these exercises really fast now. One more. Great work, let's come down. We're straight into our little crunches. So again, hands on your thighs. Let's just stay up in little pulse crunch, making sure your belly button is going into your spine. We're engaging throughout the whole core. Let's see it, 10 seconds. Looking just over your lady bits. Three, two, one. Great work, coming over into push-ups, either knees or toes, and away we go. Breathing's very important when we're doing these ones. Helps you get up. Breathing out as we're pushing up. Keeping that whole core engaged. You're nearly there. Eight seconds. Last one before we have a 30 second break. Let's put it in and rest. Let's come back into um, child's pose. Next up, we're going straight into our sumo squats with the elbow to knee. So we're coming out nice and wide. 45 degrees um, angles with our feet. And we wanna make sure that our shoulders are back and down. Are you ready? Let's go. Coming down nice and deep and up. How are you going? Good? If you can give more, let's do it. Down and up. Let's go deeper. You should feel this in your inner thighs. Squeezing up through your glutes. You've got eight seconds. And switching over, we're gonna go straight into our leg raises. So coming down and up, nice and slow and controlled. If you need to, just decrease that lever length. Doing the same action, really engaging. You're nearly there. This is the second last thing we'll be doing, the second last time, sorry, we'll be doing all the exercises. The next, turning onto our front, we're doing our mountain climbers. So let's try to stay as still as we can through our core and breathing, nice and light on the feet. 10 seconds. Three, two, one, and rest. Whew. Last set, the hardest set. Catch your breath so we can go straight in. We're gonna go with the squat jumps now. So again, let's come nice and deep into it and nice and high. Still got another 15 seconds, so enjoy the rest. We're nearly there. The majority of the workout's done, let's keep pushing hard. Are you ready? Let's come down into it, nice and low, and away we go. See how high you can get, landing nice and light on the feet. Can you give more? Yeah. You can, let's do it now. You've got 10 seconds. Coming down nice and low. Feel that like dick in the legs. Three, two, one, and coming up. Great work, let's come down into bicycles. And away we go. Feel that full twist the whole time. Let's see it, 10 seconds.
and jumping up into the burpees. Are you ready? We're gonna come nice and low and high. Ready? So we're gonna go up, down. One more, give me one more. Great work, you've got a 30 second break. We're nearly there. We're doing each set one more time, and then we're done, we're gonna stretch out. Great work, let's keep up this intensity. Let's even take it to that next level. We're nearly there, we might as well put it in now. I'm not gonna be doing it later. We've got 10 seconds, then we're coming back down into the squats. Are you ready? We're gonna go just a little bit wider than shoulder width. Then we're gonna sit down into it. Away we go. Staying nice and tall and proud. Shoulders back and down, chest out. Let's see it, 10 more seconds. Looking good, can you come lower? Yes, you can. Three, two, one, and coming down onto the mat. We're going crunches. Up we go, last time. Tucking that neck in. Let's keep it going and breathing. You've got 10 more seconds. Work. Let's turn on to our front. We've got push-ups. You ready if you can? This is the last set. Let's give it everything. Try your toes. We've got a 30 second break after this. Sack that belly button into your spine. Back in your pelvis. Five seconds. Great work. Come down, just relax. Let's keep it up. Our next exercise are the sumo squats. Still got 15 seconds of rest though. Enjoy it while it lasts. Okay, let's roll up. Okay, set into position. Are you ready? 45 degree angle with the feet. And up we go. Making sure that that knee is coming to our elbow every time, coming nice and deep into it. Ten seconds. That's it. Nearly there. One more. Great work. Let's come down. We've got leg raises, one of my favorites. Let's work that core. So breathing out as we're bringing it down and back up. That's it. Again, if you need to, you can regress it, make it easier by reducing that lever length. Do whatever you can. We don't want our back moving around too much. Next up, we've got the mountain climbers. Let's go on to our front. Are you ready? Last ones. Here we go. Let's see it. Nearly there. 10 seconds. Give it your all now. Let's go. Five, four, three, two, one. And jumping up. 30 second rest into our last set. Let's work now, you guys have done so well at home. We're going into our squat jumps. We've got 20 seconds of rest. So this time we wanna try to get as far down as we can, jumping up as high as we can go. Let's do this, nearly there, so close. Are you ready? Away we go, we're coming down and jumping up.
Coming nice and low into it. You gotta say it even lower, even higher. You've got 20 seconds. You might as well finish this workout well. There's no point going through and giving up now. The mind gives up before the body does. You've got five seconds. One more. Whew. Great work. Let's come down into bicycles. Where we go. Let's get that full twist. Belly button into your spine. I've drilled that into you all day. Hopefully you know it by now. 10 more seconds. That's it. Three, two, one. And jumping up, last set of burpees. Are you ready? Let's do this. Jumping up and down. Ten seconds. Give me one more now. One more. And last one. Great work. You guys are done. Let's stretch it out. We're gonna start with our quads. Bring that foot up to your bottom. That's it. Deeper stretch. Let's bring that knee back. Press your heel into your bottom. Let's change it over. Whew. Hope you guys are sweating as much as me. <laughs> Sweating's good for you. Remove the toxins. Let's go into a hamstring stretch now. So bringing one foot forward, making sure our feet are in line and we're pushing down on the supporting leg. That's it. Try and bring this toe to the knee. Great work. Sitting down into it and let's switch. Can you feel the heart rate coming down? Doesn't take long. It was hard while we were doing it, but now, now it seems fine. That's it. Let's stretch out the chest. So you're interlacing your fingers behind your back and let's try to lift it up. Feeling that stretch. And in front. Stretching out your upper back. Staying nice and soft through the knees. We don't want them locked out. We're just nice and soft. Let's bring that arm across now. That's it. This is a good shoulder stretch. And switching. We're nearly there. Let's stretch out those triceps now. Switching. See, and biceps. I hope you've enjoyed week four of our workouts. So we've already done that one. Let's go biceps. We'll place our palms facing towards the sky. You've got another two weeks to go. Hope you enjoy it and you're seeing some progress, I'm sure you are. Let's turn our palms over. Keep it up. That's it. Make sure you nourish yourself wisely after your workout. Drink lots of water to rehydrate. Thanks for working out with me today. My name's Moira, I'm from Babes on the Run. And enjoy the next two weeks, thanks.